Hey, it's Dina Colada here, and I've noticed for myself and maybe you, you really want to use Instagram from your computer and not on your phone. There are social media experts that think you can't get an Instagram account signing up on your computer, but that's not true. I'm going to show you the easy way to sign up for Instagram using your computer today. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to type into Google um, Instagram Chrome extension. So if you want to use this, you will need to use Chrome as your browser. So we're going to type on, click on that. And let's see, we're going to scroll down and I'm going to show you my favorite one. My favorite one is desktop for Instagram. I'm sure that some of these other ones are fine, but this is what the logo looks right here. You're going to just simply click add to Chrome. Um, it can read and change all the data on the website you visit. And I'm going to click add extension. I actually already have this extension on my computer. And after you download it, you can go up to the right hand corner and see all of your Chrome extensions. And here's what my Instagram, that's what my desktop for Instagram looks like. Since I have two um, desktop for Instagrams on my computer, I have two different looking Chrome extension icons. Here's the first one. And I think this is just a new updated version of their icon here. So yours might look like either of those. And it's amazing. It pulls up Instagram straight onto your desktop like this. Okay, and you can use it just like Instagram on your computer. You can add graphics, you can post quotes, you can add to your story. But what I want to show you today is how to actually sign up for a new account using Instagram. So I'm going to go here to my settings and I'm going to log out. All right, and then here we go. I'm going to switch accounts from uh, the Dina Colada. So I'm going to switch accounts here. Don't have an account? Simply sign up. So I need to type in my number. Click next. So easy, right? So I need to get that confirmation code they sent to my phone. And we go, oh. And I'll have to make sure and blur this out so no one can snag my account. Um, I missed a number there. Click next. Put my name in there. Click next. Oh. Hmm. Now it asked for my full name, but I don't want it to be my name. I want it to be my new website's name, which is Life Dating Love. So I'm going to click next. Welcome to Instagram, Life Dating Love. So cool, my name is available. I'm pretty psyched about that. Then we'll click Next. And let's see, connect to Facebook. I'll go ahead and do that because I have a ton of friends on Facebook. Okay, so now I wanna upload my profile photo. And just so you know, to get the best looking profile photo, you want your image to be 180 pixels by 180 pixels. So we're gonna click next and I'm gonna find my already created logo. Oh, let's see. Okay, so now all I need to do is add my profile photo. And to get the most optimized and best looking image, you wanna have it at 180 by 180 pixels. So it looks good on desktop or on mobile. So I'm going to go and pick out my JPEG. I thought I had a JPEG. There we go. Um, I tried to upload a GIF, a, a .gif extension, and it wouldn't actually work there. So I think that looks pretty good. I'm going to save it. 
All right, awesome. Now I have um, my first image and post onto my Instagram feed. Now all I need to do now is do a cover photo and that's for another video. I hope this has been helpful and I hope that you will click like and subscribe to my channel for more business tips to launch, grow, and scale your business. All right, I look forward to seeing you again. Bye.